All right, this is day 10 of doing the, basically just typing the Bible. Um, yeah, we are on day 10. We're on Matthew chapter 11. Here are the current stats here. Uh, 6,400 words typed, 294 verses, 10 total chapters. And uh, you, can, you can look at these stats if you want, but we already covered the main ones. But here is the graph. Uh, right here is a glitch, by the way, uh, in the system, the website, like, just said I got zero words per minute for these. But yeah, we're looking, we're averaging around 90% accuracy, 92% maybe. So uh, really cool stuff. And uh, yeah, so our, we capped at 138 words per minute. So that's our high, our low is 32. So like, yeah, let's go ahead and get started though with Matthew chapter 11. And uh, let's see how long this bad boy is. We got 30 verses today. And uh, yeah, so this is chapter 11. We are in the English Standard Version. So let's go ahead and get started. We're going to go for accuracy today. I'm hoping to get around 95. Uh, so the words per minute might be a little lower, but that's okay. We'll, uh, we'll figure it out. So yeah, let's go ahead and get started. When Jesus had finished instructing his 12 disciples, he went on from there to teach and preach in their cities. Now, when John heard in prison about the deeds of the Christ, he sent word by his disciples and said to him, are you the one who is to come or shall we look for another? And Jesus answered them, Go and tell John what you hear and see. The blind receive their sight and the lame walk. Lepers are cleansed and the deaf hear. And the dead are raised up and the poor have good news preached to them. And the blessed is the one who is not offended by me as as they went away Jesus began to speak to crowds concerning John what did you go out into the wilderness to see a reed shaken by the wind. What then did you go out to see? A man dressed in soft clothing? Behold, those who wear soft clothing are in king's houses. What then did you go out to see? A prophet? Yes, I tell you. And more than a prophet. This is he of whom it is written. Behold, I send my messenger before your face who will prepare your way before you. Truly, I say to you, among those born of women, there has arisen no one greater than John the Baptist, yet the one who is least in the kingdom of heaven is greater than he. From the days of John the Baptist until now, the kingdom of heaven has suffered violence and the violence take it by force for all the prophets and the law prophesied until John and if you are willing to accept it he is Elijah who is to come he who has ears to hear let him hear but to what shall I compare this generation? 
it is like children sitting in the marketplaces and calling to their playmates. We played the flute for you and you did not dance. We sang a dirge and you did not mourn. For John came neither eating nor drinking and they say he has a demon the son of man come eating or came eating and drinking and they say look at him a gluten and a drunk bird a friend of tax collectors and sinners yet wisdom is justified by her deeds then he began to denounce the cities where most of his mighty works had been done because they did not repent woe to you Chorazin, woe to you, Bethsaida, for if the mighty works done in you had been done in Tyre and Sidon, they would have repented long ago in sackcloth and ashes. But I tell you, it will be more bearable on the day of judge meant for Tyre and Sidon than for you. And you, Capernaum, will you be exalted to heaven. You will be brought down to Hades. For if the mighty works done in you had been done in Sodom, it would have remained until this day. But I tell you that it will be more tolerable on the day of judgment for the land of Sodom than for you. At that time, Jesus declared, I thank you, Father, Lord of heaven and earth that you have hidden these things from the wise and understanding and revealed them to little children yes father for such was your gracious will all things have been handed over to me by my father and no one knows the son except the father and no one knows the father except the son and anyone to whom the son chooses to reveal him come to me all who labor and are heavy laden and i will give you rest take my yoke upon you and learn from me for i am gentle and lowly in heart and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. Very nice. So, I found that as I was going for accuracy, I wasn't fully engaged with the text because I was focused on typing more than, than I want to be. So that's good to know moving forward. But we did achieve um, higher accuracy than normal, which is cool. Um, we had 21 fire words, four super streaks, 34 streaks, 650 words, 93 accuracy, and 90 words per minute. Very cool stuff. That is Matthew 11, and this has been day number 10. Hopefully you all enjoyed, and I will see you in future episodes. Take care, and peace.